Hello. Hello, hello, hello. Um, sorry, Dan. There's, there is a cap to how much David can be jacked. Um, hi, welcome to Simly the Jess. I'm Jess Bryant. This is Simly the Jess presents uh, Quarantine Action Parenting. <laughs> Exciting. Um, so uh, we... <laughs> We can only make him so jacked, okay? The slider only goes so far, you guys. <laughs> um, so, uh, yeah, welcome back. Um, uh, last Tuesday, we had a subscribers-only event that you may have missed, uh, or probably not if you're here already at 1 o'clock, um, where uh, we built our QAW, Quarantine Action Wrestling Family, a brand new home to live in. Um, the, uh, the fans decided that they wanted to see a mansion a, um, a haunted mansion. And so the fans got a haunted mansion. And I, I figure we should um, start today's video by taking our uh, our Sims uh, or, or our fans on a tour of the house. First though, let's check in with our family. Let's see. Everyone's just standing out front waiting to see what their new house is gonna look like. Uh, everyone's wearing their hot weather clothes. Yeah, you, my computer's actually doing okay. Um, so far so good. My computer in 2016, this computer was extremely powerful. So in 2021, it's all right. So um, here we have uh, Diamond David Thomas, the uh, commissioner of Quarantine Action Wrestling, which you can watch Thursdays at 8 p.m. right here on 2MB Studios. We have the former interim uh, commissioner, uh, the governor of uh, New Jersey right here. Let's see, uh, you know, we've got Claire Bear, the Slamazon, a juice box, Delia Payne, KTD, and Lloyd Legacy Sharp. So uh, obviously uh, this is a, a gorgeous two-story mansion. Uh, it's haunted uh, with an eye patch. Yes, with an eye patch. He's finally got his eye patch like he does in the show. So there he is. He's got his nice eye patch. <laughs> anyway, so um, let's start. Let's start on the first floor. All right, so you walk in, you know, we have our grand staircase that took forever for me to figure out how to make. Um, let's see, we've got um, our knights, you know, protecting, protecting our, our don't look down here yet. That's, you're not ready for that. So um, we've got a living area, you know, with, um, this is like the formal living area. We have um, a fireplace, which could catch on fire and kill someone. Um, we have a, a grand piano, um, some easels for some art. We have a bar. Um, we have, uh, per request of Dan Chapman, also known as Education, um, a gorgeous uh, window-facing bathroom with a toilet. You know, looks right out to the beautiful uh, seascape back here. Um, there's also a globe bar. Oh, I thought we put a globe bar in here. No, I guess it's just the globe. I guess it's just the globe. You know what? We can fix that. Um, let's see. There's a, a okay on the other side of the house. You know, we have a, another smaller bathroom. I wanted to put this closer to um, where the toddlers' room is, um, so that it would be easier to like get them into the bathroom. We also have a home gym for uh, since considering that we're all wrestlers, um, I think that makes sense. Um, we have a kitchen, obviously. Uh, we have a, a, a wood burning stove. You just burn, you just put it right on the floor. It's totally fine. Um, and then we have the special table for, for toddlers only. Um, there's not a bidet right now, but there could be. Uh, of course we have the toddler's room with all of their toddler toys and things. We have some potties, um, some different beds for all the different kids. Uh, let's see. Uh, we have a Stark AF dining room because I didn't have time to like decorate it. Uh, then of course we have the backyard, which uh, has a grill, which also could catch on fire and kill someone. Uh, we have a, a pool, which could drown someone. Um, and then of course, uh, let's see, we have a, a koi pond. Uh, like it's, it's a water garden. So we could stock it with koi, piranha, sharks, or sprites. I don't know what sprites do, but I do know that sharks and piranhas could kill someone. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to have, uh, I'm going to have David 
fill the pond with sharks. Yeah, definitely, definitely shark pond. Okay, and while he does that, we will continue looking around. So um, if you've been following this game at all, you or the show at all, you know that um, David likes to abandon his family. Um, and he requires some solitude. So we have built this beautiful um, <laughs> panic silo. It's not a panic room. It's a panic silo. Um, the igloo, we tried to do an igloo, but it, you know, it just wasn't going to work. So we made a silo <laughs> instead. Uh, and it's, you know, it doesn't have a lot in it. It's just got David's bed. And we're going to go ahead and assign this. Oh, wait, hold on. I'm not sure which way he'll get off. We'll just sign it all. We'll assign it all to David. There we go. All right. Let's see. Yes, absentee dad and absentee commissioner. It's true. Um, okay. So I think we did here. Now, um, the the piece de resistance of this house, I think, um, is the sex dungeon. <laughs> so, yes, Vol yeah, Ashley Volts, Voltic McMoon did help uh, create this house. So, so this is our sex dungeon. Um, we've got a hot tub, a hookah, a bar, um, some, 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 <laughs> yeah, some, some beds for, for sex things. Um, it's kind of weird because it is a, a two dad, six children family situation here, but, um, I, I have to do what the chat demands. Um, so this is. This is what we have. We have a we have a sex dungeon. Maybe we'll be able to get the nanny down here. I have a feeling. I have a bad feeling that this show is going to devolve into like the players having with sex with as many NPCs as possible. Um, and I don't know how I feel about that. Anyway, um, let's see. Second floor. I didn't. I didn't do uh, to do too much in here. Um, but let's see. We've got uh, we've got Claire Bear's bedroom. Okay, um, she's got her, her art table, she's got her violin, okay, she's got a journal, she's got this cute canopy bed. Then over here, I bet you can guess, this is Slamazon's bedroom, okay, she's got her computer so she can practice typing. She's got this cute cat, then uh, we've got this Stark AF bedroom, I mean bathroom. Um, this is an empty room, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. Then let's see, we've got a karaoke machine, which should come in handy. Um, we've got a TV with a, with a game station. We have a woodworking table. Uh, we have a DJ booth, that should be cool. Um, we have a pipe organ. We have the kids playroom, okay, with um, a, a castle dollhouse, a puppet theater, another art table. Um, a video game station for kids, and then um, a science table, which can catch on fire and kill someone. Um, let's see, here we have Juice Box's room. Um, he's got his own TV, so he can build up his his social skills with funny with with his his, his funny skill or his, his, his comedy skill. Um, he also has a journal that he can write in to build up his social skill. And then, of course, uh, he's got this nice closet to show off all of his ridiculous clothing. Then over here, this is the governor's room. It's got um, a podium from which he can um, <laughs> he can apodiate. He can talk um, from there. He can practice his his charisma skill. <laughs> um, I know I didn't give you a rug, John. I'm sorry. Here, let's let's find let's find the governor a rug real quick because it just looks so sad and upsetting. Let's see. Let's get. We could get him a magic carpet. Oh, that's too small. That's way too small. It's not going to work. How about this one? Oh, that's still kind of small, huh? Oh, here we go. This is a little better. Let's see. Mm, I don't know if I love that color. Oh, I got this problem again. I don't want to stop sharing my screen by accident. There we go. That, that works, right? All right. Maybe we can put some art on the wall here. Put a little art. Let's see. What would the governor like on his wall? Um, how about some movie posters? We'll put some movie posters on his wall. We got some Bob pancakes. I I bet the governor is pro cop. We'll put some we'll put some a cop show. There you go. Very nice. Okay. And then, like I said, obviously, 
Uh, David's bedroom is back here. Oh, and one detail that I forgot to uh, to talk about is that this is a Murphy bed. This is the this is going to be the governor's bed, and um, it can uh, it can kill you. So we'll see what happens. Um, although I bet the governor is just going to go sleep in the sex dungeon instead. I don't know. We'll see what we can do about that. Um, this is supposed to be another bathroom. I never finished it. Here, I'll just do that real quick. Um, the more bathrooms you have, the better. The more, well, I guess it depends on what your goal is. Here, we'll get a talking toilet for this bathroom. Oh yeah, golden black. A golden black talking toilet. Unfortunately, there aren't any talking sinks. No, Dan, no Batu bathroom. Actually, that's one of the things that I don't like about the Batu pack is that uh, there are no bathroom items because when you go to Batu, you don't sleep or use the bathroom. You just like go into your house and freshen up, which whatever, man, it's frustrating. I feel like they did a bad job. All right. So now here's another bathroom for our friends. Uh, and I think, I think that's the complete tour of the house so far. So I'm sure things will change. Oh, uh, you know, I'd have to get a cheat code to get a pet because we always we already have eight folks in here. Uh, and I don't know what the cheat code is off the top of my head to be able to have more than eight. Yeah, we have sharks now. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> OK, well, let's uh, let's get into it with our new home. All right. So I. Oh man, I don't even remember what the hell we're supposed to be doing. Um, so, <laughs> so the idea that is that this is the toddler challenge, right? Where we can't control any adults. We can only control, <laughs> yeah, up, down, up, down, be a like shark. Yeah, I think you're right. Um, okay, David, as I've said <laughs> repeatedly, there's only so jacked that you can get. And if you want to get more jacked, you're just going to have to use the gym like everybody else. Okay, you're just gonna have to use the gym. Um, so, right, we can only control the kids and the toddlers. This should be interesting. Oh, I also thought it would be interesting to see how much, how many simoleons is this house worth? Here, we're gonna call this the QAW, oops, that is not how you spell that. The QAW compound. Uh, the QAW haunted compound. And how, I can't see. It is worth 237,287 simoleons. I'm not quite sure what the exchange rate is, uh, simoleons to dollars, but I feel like that's a lot. Okay, so the idea is, oh my God, did he like pass out outside? He did. I wonder if he can make it to a bed. Which one was supposed to be his bed? Oh yeah. Is that Lord Legacy Sharp? I think we decided that this... Uh-oh. Ha! Ah! Claire Bear is going through a phase. She found a spirit animal. Or I like to say Patronus. Because if you're white, you don't have spirit animals. Do not. Do not discount me in the chat. I will boot your ass. Um, Claire will only want to wear her bear suit. So Claire only wears a red bear suit from here on out. Oh, she's using the, the beautiful... The beautiful seaside facing toilet. It's very nice. Oh, you're right. There should be an arcade game. Let's do that. Let's find a place for the arcade game. Where is it? Here it is. God, it's huge. Oh, we can put it right here. No, because then we can't see the bathroom as well. Here, we'll put it back here. All right. We have an arcade game. All right. Um... Who missed the tour? Oh, God, David. Of course you missed the tour. It's fine. Um, no, you have not kissed yet. You don't, I don't think you even have romantic feelings for each other. I don't know that you talk to each other at all. Yeah, you don't even talk to each other. But, you know, um, whatever the uh, fans want, the fans get. So, I'm just saying, if the fans want a, uh, a a <laughs> governor and DDT tryst in the sex dungeon, in the woohoo dungeon, then uh, then that is what they will get. Um, <laughs> hey, 
I'll remember my sticky note uh, when you show up to my stream on time. Okay. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah, some tarps. Oh, God, I should put tarps down there. That's funny to me. All right, hold on. Let's find a tarp. Let's find a tarp that we can put down. Tarp. It says it's not a tarp. It says it's a tarp. Let's see. We want it to fit. Oh, yeah. This is the one right here. I'm just going to put this tarp down right here under the paint. Because we don't want to cover up the drain in the floor, but we do want to protect the floor as much as possible. Okay. All right. Uh, let's see. it's going to take for people to die but it's almost certainly going to happen oh look ah, uh -huh. oh he lost his eye patch uh -huh. oh. ow. <laughs> <laughs> he goes ow that's funny to me uh -huh. alright we got to focus on who did I decide we were going to focus on Katie Lane. Katie Katie needs to have fun I don't know if you can even climb these stairs Guess we'll find out. You know what? I'm gonna cheat. Oh, I can't even. What just happened? Oh, David reached fitness level two. Oh, yeah. So, um, oh, it's better now. Yeah. Sometimes my um, my mic goes in and out. I can't help it. I don't know why. I think it's something to do with my internet. Oh god, if he destroys this. Okay, no, he's just gonna play dolls. That's fine. Um, Atelia needs to go potty. Let's see. Oh, she's pooping in her pants. Did you just see that? It was a big green cloud, and she pooped in her pants, and that is not cool. Oh, but she did reach level four of the communication skill. That's pretty good. Let's get rid of this. All right. Uh, she kind of needs a nap. Now she's gonna need a bath because she pooped in her pants. Good job. Let's see. She can ask David for a diaper change. Let's see. Uh, help. What? Adopt as caregiver? What? Oh, for God's sake. All right, I can't see it because my Zoom is in the... Oh, God, she's naked. Oh, dear. Okay, she's going to ask someone to give her a bath. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay. KTD needs to go potty. Who is this? Oh, this has to be Claire Bear. <laughs> Claire Bear is legitimately a bear now. I'm sad that Grace is at work because I think she'd be really happy to see this. <laughs> She's Claire Bear is a strawberry bear. I'm going to get a quick, uh, quick screen cap of that real fast. <laughs> Oh, there's food over here. Someone made some food. Oh, wow. David made some grilled plantains on the grill. All right. Practice typing for four hours. Slamazon needs to go up to her bedroom and practice typing. Man, we've just started and I'm already overwhelmed. Practice typing. Okay. Okay. Yeah, bear because Claire Bear. That's true. Um, I know. It's a phase she's going through. That's what she's decided. No, you're not going to take a nap. You're going to go here. Can they not climb the stairs? Oh, my God. These fucking stairs. They can't climb the stairs. Why not? Can you go here? Okay, she can make it halfway up the stairs. Mo house, more problems, seriously. Okay, now go here. Why? All right. Oh my god. <sighs> Goose Fraba. Okay. Um, I definitely should have play tested those stairs, I guess, huh? All right. You know what we're gonna do? It's fine. You know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna put a ladder in. And I'll fix it later. We're gonna put a ladder. We're 
Where can I put a ladder? Can I put it here, right there? Oh, that's not what I want. Ah, oh, god damn it. I want to put a ladder somewhere here. We'll put a ladder. Yeah, right there. There we go. And then I'm just going to go ahead and probably delete that stuff. We're gonna, uh, oh man. Okay, it could be worse. My computer is uh, slowing down a little bit, but that's all right. Okay, now can she go here? See if her little head pops up through the ground. <laughs> it's a money pit. <laughs> we need a sex attic for the sex addicts. Hey oh. Okay, good. She can make it up the ladder. All right, so she needs to practice typing. That just took so long to get her to practice typing. She's taking a bath in the golden tub. Claire Bear has fallen asleep in David's bed. That makes sense. I guess I should assign these beds. This is Claire's bed. Uh, this is Slamazon's bed. And then... Wait! Why did she get up? I don't understand why that's the thing that makes them get up. Uh, and then this is Juicebox's bed. And then the governor's bed is supposed to be this one, but I don't think I can assign it to him. I have to have him put it down. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens if he puts the bed down with himself by accident. Moment of truth. Come on, hurry up. P. Ah, he must have gotten in the pool. Oh, good. He didn't kill himself. All right. Okay. Claire Bear is making a me oh, no, it's not Claire Bear. I keep calling her Claire Bear. No, no, no. I know that you can't climb the stairs. Uh, oh god, she needs to sleep. Oh wow. The kids are in the kids are in bad shape, and they're the ones I'm supposed to be paying attention to. Okay. <laughs> what are the physics? Uh, I think the physics are you just have to be really, really strong to get your ass up this ladder because it is straight up and down. Uh, okay. Wow, it is 10.30 at night. When did that happen? I've got to get these kids in bed. Slamazon. Whatever you're doing, stop doing it. We've got to get you some food. Oh, jeez. The food's all the way downstairs. <laughs> Look at somebody's grilling up a storm. It's David. David won't stop grilling food <laughs> I mean I don't hate it it's great that there's food finally who knew that all I had to do was buy a grill for David to cook for his family all right Claire Bear is asleep in her own bed Slamazon's getting some food juice box is actually in really good shape what do you need to do oh he needs to make friends and stuff to achieve a high social skill let's see we'll have him let's see I'm writing his journal. Although, I think that's creative skill. And then he could watch the comedy channel. That's definitely social skill. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God, Ashley. That's really funny. <laughs> yes. You can click and drag food. Oh, my God, there's more. It keeps, <laughs> it keeps <laughs> multiplying. Uh, yeah, and then it stays good in the fridge, right? It, you know. Uh, and you can also click and drag stuff and pull it, like, into the sink, too. Uh, or into the, um, into the dishwasher. So that your Sims, you know, don't have to do that. But I feel like that makes, uh, a big difference. All right, well, we'll put this in here. Is David still grilling? Is he grilling again? Okay, good, he's gone. Where is he now? Oh, he wants to go to his bed. Okay. Uh-oh. He's going to pee himself. Oh, he didn't. He's going to use the talking toilet. <laughs> I 
<laughs> yeah, tired from grilling, it's true. That'd be great if there was a fire pole, but there's not. Oh no! Well, it is what it is, dude. Okay, where's Slamazon? Slamazon, you need to go to bed. Like, seriously. Go to bed, it's midnight. Okay, and Ashley, I don't know if you knew this, you can just click on these little things to make them do something that will that will resolve that. So if they're tired, you just click on where it has a little Z's, and then they'll go to bed. And if you've assigned them a bed, they'll go to that bed. Makes life a lot easier. Oh god, now juice box is hungry. <laughs> Ashley, is your mind blown? You want that turlet? Oh yeah, that toilet? It's a pretty cool toilet. Have you seen, but so you saw that toilet, but have you seen the gilded toilet? Ooh, ooh, ah. Okay, I think everyone's, oh, God damn it. Delia Payne, oh, she must have had a nightmare. All right, we're just gonna, we're gonna have her take a nap. Cause for some reason they won't sleep, but they will nap because that makes sense. Nap, I said. Oh my god. Why? Nap. Thank you. You can also uh, shift click, uh, Ashley. So <laughs> take Trump size dumps. It's true. Take Trump size dumps on the golden toilet. Uh, you can shift to. Uh, yes, we are recreating Hill House. Um, it's supposed to be haunted. I gave it the haunted trait, but I don't know if that just means like ghosts will show up out of nowhere or not. I don't really know. I guess we'll find out. David, where are you going, kid? Oh, that's not David. That's the governor. Where's the governor going? He's going to use the fancy toilet. I'm not sure why he went downstairs. Let's see what he does. Let's see if he makes it. He might just pee himself. Oh no, he peed himself! <laughs> Ugh, so oh, slow. he was so close. He almost made it. So <laughs> now he's going to go take a bath downstairs, even though there's literally a bunch of showers up here. He decided he's going to go all the way down the ladder again <laughs> to use the fancy swan tub wine. I know, right? Gross. Well, so ghosts appear when, like, people are dead, right? Obviously, when Sims are dead, um, ghosts will appear. <clears throat> but, uh, you know, if you just, like, give... Because, like, you can give buildings a trait, right? So you can go to the traits panel, and I give it the haunted trait. For some inexplicable reason, this lot attracts wandering ghosts. Yeah, so I guess ghosts will just show up randomly. I guess we'll find out. I almost feel like David needs his own little bathroom out here. He needs, like, a, a toilet in his room or something. I don't think we can squeeze one in there, though. We could probably squeeze a toilet in down here, though. Let's do it. Actually. Um, so... <laughs> adults uh, sometimes auto-pee. Uh, it just kind of depends on... I don't know. I have no idea. Sometimes they will, sometimes they don't. They have free will, so sometimes they prefer to be doing other things. What the hell? What is she sad about? She's crying. Claire Bear is crying under the covers because... She's sad and wants to be in her bear form. Wow, that, that actually really tracks for her. That's pretty funny. She's going to go soothe herself by making some popcorn. That makes sense. Or did someone already make popcorn? Man, someone already did. With this free will on, I, I have no control. I really feel just entirely out of control. I think I'm just going to focus on the toddlers because if I try to focus on anything else, I just simply cannot do it. All right, stop crying and sleep. Stop crying. Stop crying. <laughs> She wants to change her clothes. She wants to play a tablet game. We can definitely make those things happen. Oh, I canceled it by accident. Oh, God, it's three in the morning and everyone's awake. 
Stop, stop. Why? Okay, he's hungry. He's going to get some popcorn. They're both hungry. You know what? I don't really want them to get popcorn. I want them to have like real food. So I'm going to open this up and see what we can give them. Let's give them some, uh, let's get them some of this. Grab a serving of that instead. You're going to be a lot happier if you do that. And I think, yeah, poor, poor Lloyd Legacy Sharp. He needs some attention. He needs a bath. This is, this is out of control. It's not good. Claire Bear is hitting herself in the face with popcorn. Why not? <laughs> the governor finally finished with his bath. It's going back up the stairs. <laughs> why wouldn't you? You know, why not? Okay, Claire Bear. Have you finished eating yet? Look at her. She's so miserable. She got the boo boo lip. She's got the, the boo boo. Yeah, the, yeah. The kids are running the joint. Okay. Oh my gosh. Once they've eaten, I think. Well, Claire Bear. Claire Bear does need to go back to bed though because. <laughs> I think she has to go to school in the morning and stuff. You know. And I think I saw that it was already KTD's birthday. Oh my god, it is. How bad did we fail? Ugh. Well, he's not the uh, sharpest tool in the shed, but that's okay. He's got, he's got good movement skill. Okay, well, we'll see how much higher we can get some of these other ones. Um, Potty is really close to being number three, although we don't really need that. It doesn't do anything. Uh, let's see if we can get imagination to four. So we'll have him draw with Llama when he's done. Whatever, whatever the fuck it is he's doing. Oh, God. He needs a bath so bad. I don't even know what I can do about that. Maybe he can take his clothes off. Where are you even going? Oh, I think he's just going to put his dish down. Where's Claire Bear? Claire Bear, go to bed. Yes, thank you. No, don't cry in your bed. I want you to sleep in your bed. Back float? Oh, she's going to go get in the... <laughs> Maybe she'll drown. Okay, um, I'm going to stop paying attention to her. No, he's still gross and stinky. He needs an adult. I need an adult! I need an adult! <laughs> Oh, God. Who is that? Oh, those juice box walk by. Okay, he's hungry too, I guess. No, can't put two kids in the same tub. Ooh. It's just not... It's just not gonna work. <laughs> uh, Dave, don't spin off until you're all the way jacked. And you can't get all the way jacked until you... Oh, God, where is he going? You can't even... What are you doing? Why are you doing this? But you can't even get up the stairs. Oh, my God. If the toddler can climb the stairs, but the kids can't, I'm going to lose my fucking shit. There he goes. So why couldn't she climb the fucking stairs? Nothing makes sense in this world. Nothing. Nothing makes sense. Rebate day. What? What? What is even... Stop what you're doing. Just stop what you're doing. God, neither of the adults are asleep. Uh, well, now that you're up here, you should be able to wake the governor up. Wake him up. I don't... I don't... <laughs> I don't understand why he was able to climb the stairs when Slamazon couldn't climb the stairs. And, like, the governor doesn't climb the stairs either. So fucking weak. Get it. All right. We're just going to focus on Lord Legacy Sharp from here on out. Because I think KTD... It's, like, already over for KTD. He's going to age up any fucking second. Oh, look, all the kids are hanging out. Very cute. 
Very cute, although he needs to focus on his imagination skill. Oh man. This is like the saddest thing I've ever watched. <laughs> yeah, Ashley, I'm kind of hoping that someone will die. I feel like that makes it more interesting. You know, I like when fires start. I like when people die. Okay, there we go. Because this child desperately needs a bath. I don't know how we're going to get them both downstairs to the bath. But we're going to figure it out. Let's see what happens. He's going to pick him up. I mean, he can't. I don't think he can carry him down the ladder. So if he can't go down the stairs, yeah, he can't go down the stairs. So, oh, God damn it. We're going to have to. We'll just put. We'll just put a tub upstairs. <sighs> because the world is stupid. Okay. Put another one of these. Why not? Okay. Jesus. I, I still don't understand. <laughs> oh, Lloyd Legacy Adventures? It could be the yeah, it'd be the po most positive, uplifting show ever created. Um, assuming that we don't accidentally kill him now or get him taken away. Oh, he's pissed off. He's fucking pissed off. I think KTD reached level five, though. That's nice of communication. Good job, KTD. Right, where's KTD? Oh, he's got to go potty. Go potty. Stop what you're doing. David's just hanging out. I wonder if David's going to make it to work today. Yeah, he's supposed to go to work today. We'll see what happens. Okay, Delia Payne. Ooh, he's hungry. Okay, let's get Delia Payne some food so that she doesn't die. We'll get her a hamburger. Grab a serving, Delia Payne. While KTD poops in the corner. Who is off the island? No one's off the island yet. Yeah, if the governor and David both go to work, the nanny will show up. Which is um, generally best for everyone. <laughs> All right. KTD maxed out his potty skill. See? Why can the toddlers go up and down the stairs, but everyone else can't? That's really interesting. I don't understand. Oh, who is off of KTD grows up? Well... I only add characters between episodes because I feel like it's like a lot of stuff that isn't super interesting to watch. But I should be able to uh, get a cheat that allows me to have more than eight people in the house. In fact, I know that that is a thing because people do it online all the time. I'm just not quite sure how to do it. I have to look it up. I haven't looked it up in a while. So I'm sure... I'm sure we can make that happen. So uh, no one really has to get voted off. Okay, we're going to open this up. After he potties, he needs to eat two. Let's see. We'll get Lord Legacy, I think, would be interested in some asado. Some, uh, some various meats. Yeah, after he pees, he'll have some various meats. Oh, yeah, we're going to hire that nanny. I wonder if it's going to be the same nanny. Since we moved, it might not be the same nanny. KTD, stop crying. Here, grab a serving. You'll be fine. Stop walking like that. You're crank a lank. And uh, Lloyd Legacy has decided he's not going to do anything. Yay! It is the same nanny. Excellent. Is someone going to let her in? or Where is everybody? Where's Delia Payne? <laughs> she won't stop crying. Here. Play with play with her. 
Talk to her. Wrestle with her. You'll be fine. All right. We're eating. We're pooping. We're playing. There's pee on the floor. It's totally okay. Are vampire nannies a thing? I don't know. <laughs> so reminiscent of my childhood, eating off the floor, pooping in the corner, and it's haunted. Wow. Um, Blumpkin Bread, we're going to have to get you as a consult, an expert consult for the show. So you probably have uh, some insight that we don't we don't have the filth oh ashley this is nothing this is nothing you should have seen it okay the candidate is whistle stop wimp the candidate is due to appear on stage at any minute but they're having a panic attack about their entire campaign the governor must act quickly to keep the speech in motion boost candidate's ego or guilt trip the candidate i think he would boost the candidate's ego i'm pretty sure that's what the governor would do the governor lists the potential accomplishments of the candidate, but the sheer weight of the campaign collapses on them like a weight, and <laughs> the entire speech is canceled. Oh, no. Whoops. Okay. KTD. Uh, also needs attention. Yay, I'm so glad that it's the same... It's the same person. The same nanny. Oh, and check out this uh, trash can. Ready? Oh, <gasps> we get money every time we put something in the trash can because it recycles. Oh, but you can only do it every so often. You can't do it all the time. Okay, when it turns green, you can do it. Money. I love money. So that way we won't have to worry about bills ever again. We just throw things away. Yay. Today on Simly the Jess, Jess throws things away. Okay. KTD. What do you need? You still need imagination skill. I would really like to make this happen. So, here, play with this cat toy. Alright, where's Lloyd Legacy Sharp? Lloyd Legacy Sharp is eating. Oh, he really needs fun and attention. So, let's see. Maybe you can play with Imani. You can talk about party. You can talk about trucks. Claire Bear, you, you gotta keep doing something. You gotta keep working on those skills. That's not Claire Bear. Why do I keep calling Delia Payne Claire Bear? I can't help it. Yeah, where is Lloyd Legacy Sharp? Hashtag rut row. That's true. Okay, potty level one still. Oh god, I don't even want to know what these bills are gonna be. The bills are ten thousand five hundred and ninety-four dollars. Holy shit! Oh my god, that's really bad. Oh my god, she's naked again. <laughs> okay, uh, let's see. I'm gonna have her play dolls. Uh huh. Let's see. I don't understand. What's up with Lloyd Legacy Sharp's, like, issue filling this attention <laughs> bar? It was the same thing last time. Like, the for some reason, it just wouldn't fill up. Even when I debugged him. There it goes. Okay, it is working. I guess he's just an attention whore. <laughs> you guys, stop fighting! Stop! Stop fighting! Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Oh, there we go. It is going up. What else can we do together? We can make funny faces. Let's get rid of some of this stuff. Let's do stuff that we know is going to work. Play. Wiggle in there. That should probably help a lot. Okay, there we go. Getting better. Oh my God, they're gonna have to kiss to reconcile. Maybe we'll spend a spend a little quality time in the hot tub in one of the two hot tubs. Runa, 
Oh my goodness. Oh, Lloyd Legacy reached level 5 of the communication skill! He's killing it! Look at this. Huh? Yay! For the movement skill! Wow! Oh, but the rest of them are pretty bad. Oh, and Bobby! Oh! I don't have those lot traits that helps the kids learn faster. I, I do want to do that. That's not cheating. That's not cheating. It's not cheating. It just isn't. So it's fine. All right. <laughs> they have six neglected children. Of course they have time to fall in love. Huh? Yeah. Um, I mean, they're not spending time taking care of the children. They must be spending their time doing something. All right, I think he needs to sleep, because otherwise he's going to pass out on the floor again, and I don't want that to happen. Okay, so kids learn faster when they work with an adult. So we're going to work with Imani on Delia's thinking skill. Come on. There we go. Any second now. Hey, David, look, Imani's wearing chucks. She must go to the same... Who is this? Oh, she wants to run. Oh, I better put that food in the fridge. All right, wow. I don't think we've ever had a more peaceful time in a long time. Ah, I can breathe. And then the kids will come home. And it'll be miserable again. Uh, uh, Sarah Ben. <laughs> that was that was a glitch in the Matrix. That wasn't her Blair witching, I don't think. Uh, no, no one's gone to the dungeon yet that I know of. Um, although you would think that that hot tub has a pretty strong pull for the for their free will, so I'm surprised they haven't. Yeah, when the Sims have free will, like, certain items are more attractive to them than others, depending on, like, their traits and stuff. But some things are, like, super attractive no matter what. So, like, um, computers are super attractive to Sims. Like, they always want to go. Oh, God. The kids are home. Oh, God. And the governor. But I think Claybear has, has an A. She wants to be a bear. All right, fine. You can be a bear. We got to find you a mirror or something. Or a wardrobe. Is there a wardrobe? No. Shit, where's the closest mirror? Here's one. Uh, let's put her in a bear outfit. Because she's going to cry if we don't put her in a bear outfit. Put laundry down there. I mean, yeah, so, okay. So the, uh, <laughs> the objects don't, like, beckon to people. I'm always out of the screen. I'm going to move my camera. Um... It's just that they're, like, inherently more attractive. You know? They just... Oh, why am I... Okay. Now I'm in the center. Um, you know, they're just, like, things that people like to do. Why is she going that way? Check up on. Who are you checking up on? And why are you not doing what I tell you to do? What the... All right. Whatever. I want her... <sighs> Ugh... Why is it so hard? And why is she going through there? Nothing makes sense. Okay. Uh, you know what we'll do is we'll just put a mirror here. I forgot to put mirrors in the bathrooms, I'm realizing now. So maybe I should do that. Oh, I don't like that. That'll do. Okay. I put her in a bear outfit. Put laundry down there. In the dungeon? Are you serious? Ugh. That doesn't make any sense. That can't possibly be in the way. But you know what? Here, we'll just put it, we'll put it, we'll put it here. <laughs> we'll just put a medicine cabinet in the hallway. Why not? All right, this is my last attempt to put her in a bear outfit. If this doesn't work, I'm giving up. 
Okay, here we go. While I'm here, we can fix uh, David. Burloyerna. Okay. Let's give her a second outfit. Okay, where is the bear? She was a strawberry. A strawberry bear. Okay, great. And then let's fix David's eye patch situation. Get hmm. more jacked. <laughs> Look at this outfit! Oh my god, so ridiculous! Okay. He needs an eye patch. God. So ridiculous. Alright. Find that eye patch. Okay. Who doesn't wear an eye patch to a party? Uh, he needs his eye patch for the pool, obviously. Okay, we get rid of these glasses. All right, eye patch, perfect. Okay, bedazzled eye patch. They're... I'm not. <laughs> there were some funny eye patches online that I thought about downloading, but then I didn't. I mean, I guess I could. <laughs> oh, he's so tense. Okay. But now we can have her change her outfit and put on her bear outfit, and then she should be happy again. Okay, good. She's happy again. She's hungry, so she should go eat something. Not popcorn. Oh my God. She's, like, obsessed with popcorn. Oh, she's got a lot of projects she needs to do. She's got a school project. Okay, then she can start working on that. Juice box. And Slam is on her, hanging out outside. And he's making a mess. Stop it. Uh, we gotta find people for him to be friends with. Uh... Man, why is this so hard? Ooh, what's this? A cherry tree. Uh, where are we gonna find humans for Juice Box to be friends with? All right, first of all, he needs to eat something. Then maybe we can go out into the community and get some friends for Juice Box. Uh, let's have him eat something. Okay, I think all the toddlers are asleep. Can we get anybody up? Okay, we can get KTD up. I want him to play with this because I think his imagination skill is still really low. Oh no, he did get level four. Let's see if he can max some stuff out. Yeah, right? Those monkey bars are, uh, they're real cute. Look how cute this is. This is freaking adorable. Okay, David brought home some money. A cage? Absolutely not. Where's Delia Payne? She must be in this bed here. She is. Okay. All right. She needs to practice typing. Let's get her upstairs to practice typing. Practice typing. We're going to put it on here a couple times because sometimes she just doesn't do it. Okay. And then juice box. I could have sworn we told him to get some fucking food. And then he didn't do it because he's a little shit. Okay. Everybody's eating bananas. Wow. Claire reached mental level. Oh, I thought it said nine. It's only level two. All right. That makes more sense. Yeah, Claire, what are you supposed to be doing? Oh, yeah, she's making a solar system project. But Oh, she's already a grade A student. We're not doing this. Stop it. We're not doing this. Someone else can do it. Uh, she needs to have fun. She needs to have social. Can she, like, play with someone? No. Ooh, let's play this. 
Play the arcade game. <laughs> we definitely did not vote for our neighborhood action plan, but it's rough housing encouraged. I think that means they're supposed to fight with each other, which totally makes sense for this household. So that's fine. Okay, you ate. Why don't you use the bathroom? Then you can do your homework. Are you a grade A student? You're not, so. Oh, he's got a project. Ooh, a volcano. Fuck this shit. Let's just sell that. Juice box is going to make a volcano. You like this fridge? How fun. <laughs> the infinite pile of money we have. Actually, you can get a money vault. I suppose maybe we should get a money vault so that Diamond David Thomas can swim in his piles of money. I'm not sure where we would put it. Oh, we would put it in that room that there's nothing in. Oh, no. KTD aged up. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Well, that's all right. Uh, KTD. What aspiration would he have? Would he be a creativity kid, a mental kid, a motor kid, or a social kid? What are we, th what are we thinking? Scrooge McDiamond. Social or creative for KTD? Mm, I think social's a lot harder. So let's just do creative. <laughs> Let's do that. And then we need a, a trait for him. Let's see. KTD, he could be, he is definitely self-assured. He's con confident all the time. Let's see. Music, he is a music lover. That's true. Uh, let's see. What else? Lazy slobs. Okay. I think we're going to just go ahead. We're going to put self-assured for KTD. Let's see what he looks like. Wow, that does not look like KTD at all. Not even a little bit. Not even a little bit. All right, we're going to have him clean this up. He needs to use the bathroom, so we'll have him use the bathroom. And then we'll have him uh, plan some out. We'll, we'll dress him up. We have a Deton emoji now. Oh, my God, I love it. That's so cute. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> I love it. Oh, my God. Should Deton be the next uh, the next character we add? <laughs> yeah, we do. We're gonna need a new toddler for for next Saturday. So, uh... <laughs> so I don't know who should we who should we add? We could add uh... we could add Baby Powers. We could add uh, we could we could add Sydney Bean Salad. Uh, but we could add uh, Deton. Who else? Who else? Yeah, who else would you like to see? If you if we put some options, we'll make a poll and see uh, who's going to be the next person. Why does he have a girl's voice? This fucking game, man. Okay. Let's fix this situation. Okay. KTD's hair. He has really short, really short. He's got like one of these things going on, right? That's kind of what KTD's got going on. And KTD always wears, like, he's got these things, doesn't he? Doesn't he have sunglasses that are kind of like this? Oh, why is this sleep? Can we, oh gosh. All right, so it looks like, yeah. Let's see, AC volts, baby powers are Deton. So uh, they're gonna put a poll in the chat. And uh, then you guys will be able to pick something. Oh, come on. Adults have, like, sunglasses that look like KTD sunglasses that he wears. Mm. I guess these are pretty close. Mm -hmm. These are kind of like KTD sunglasses. I think these are the closest. Let's do that. And then um, he definitely needs a necklace of some kind. I don't know. I'm not sure. Give him that one. Yeah. 
I don't know. Anyway, and it's hot weather now. So we'll give him like a tank top, maybe. Okay, the poll is live. So you can vote on who you want to be the next uh, toddler. And QAW, or excuse me, Simile the Just Presents Quarantine Action Parenting. Uh, we've got two votes for AC Volts right now, one for Deton, and Baby Powers is also on there. So, uh, you, you, you know, you ask and you shall receive. Give him some basketball shorts, maybe. Oh, these shoes are perfect. I love those shoes. That's very, it's very KTD-ish. He needs some little socks to go under his his shoes though because otherwise his feet will get angry let's see <laughs> it's his party outfit i actually don't hate it i hate the hat but the rest of it you know what that's gonna stay we'll give him some nicer shoes though <laughs> oh my god it's ridiculous i meant to hit his sleepwear because obviously you don't wear glasses to bed okay I don't hate this monster top. What else do we have? We have a dog, we have a monkey. We got some stripes. Let's see. Yeah, I kind of like the monster top. What color? I'm thinking maybe this color. I feel like he wears shorts to bed. <laughs> what an interesting uh, game. You know, now I, I barely know KTD at all IRL. I, I don't think I've ever spoken to him ever and now I'm speculating about what he wears to bed. Why not? That's normal. It's normal for adults to do that. Fine. Right, you guys? Right? Yeah. That's fine. Sure. Do you think he's a man who wears flip-flops or he's a man who does not wear flip-flops? Whatever, he's a kid. He can wear flip-flops. All right. So, uh, there's about two and a half minutes left on this poll, you guys. And uh, I'm noticing that Deton and AC Volts each are tied with 16 votes apiece. So you guys are gonna have to do something to, uh, to switch that up. Okay, let's see. Oh, Deton has pulled ahead. Yo, zip. Now, you can spend your channel points to uh, vote more than once. Oh, God. Oh, AC Volts has pu pulled ahead. Now it's 22 to 19. The poor baby powers in the in the in dead last with seven votes. It's clear that either it's going to be AC Volts or Deton. Oh, man. AC Volts now has 36, 39 to Deton's 29. I have already picked out the shoes that I will use for uh, AC Volts. So, you know, that's exciting for me. Um, oh man, 45 to 47. That's a good thing you guys have those channel points because... <laughs> oh man, 51, 53 to 53, you guys. <laughs> Can we get a prediction? Can we get a prediction going on this too? You know, bet your channel points on who's gonna win the poll. <laughs> Oh my god. 83 to 72. This is insane. Baby Power's got another vote. 15 votes. Wow. 84 to 81. Wow. I'm not sure who is in who's in there, you know, going crazy on this, but I appreciate you. This is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Actually, I thought you wanted to be the drunk aunt or something. I thought that was what you wanted. But clearly, oh, oh, I was just informed that I'm not supposed to call you the aunt. I apologize. <laughs> okay, let's see. Wow. AC Volts, 95 points. Deton, 87. 88 for Deton. 
Oh my gosh, 95, 93. This is insane. Oh my gosh, AC Volts. Oh my gosh, right at the last second, pulling ahead, 96 to 93 AC Volts will be the next toddler on Quarantine Action Parenting. Wow. Uh, I've just been told that uh, 9,400 channel points were spent on that poll to uh, pull ahead. I'm not going to tell you who spent those. Uh, <laughs> it was thrilling. That was like a that was like an eBay, right? That was like that was like an eBay auction. That was fun. All right, Lloyd Legacy Sharp, I think, has been sleeping all day. We're going to get him out of bed. We're going to have him uh, start working on things. Oh, actually, we should ask for Shape's help from somebody. Ask for Shape's help. Oh, we can ask anybody. But we'll ask the nanny because we don't care about her needs. Okay. KTD is sad because we missed his birthday. I'm sorry. Sorry, KTD. Where is the... Oh, my God. Anything. Okay. We'll have him get some leftovers because he's hungry. Oh, now he needs a room. KTD needs a room. Well, we have this we have this empty area here. Yeah, that'll work. We can make part of this. Part of this his room, and part of this will be the uh the vault. Oh god, Delia's gonna get taken away. Delia, no! Okay, let's get you something here, Delia. Eat, eat, eat some of this. You'll be happier if you eat this instead of the popcorn. Or I guess she's just decided she's definitely gonna eat that popcorn. All right, fine, whatever. Hey, what you doing, man? Did you eat? Here. Oh, you are eating. Okay, good. And then, yeah, he needs a bed to sleep in. So I guess we have to take a couple minutes and decorate a bedroom for him. Okay, let's figure this out. How are we going to make this work? Uh, well, let's see. We know the vault has to be like back here somewhere, right? So we'll make this like... Yeah, excuse you. Excuse you. Move this. Make this like a little hallway to the vault. And then this will be KTD's room. Right here. We will get, thank you. We will get an archway. I don't remember what color we were using. We're just gonna use this. Okay, okay. And then obviously we need some lights. Okay, put a light here, put a light here. Okay, and then we need some. Need some of that. Need some of that. All right. Sorry, KTD. You have like a little baby room. Okay. We might have to. We might have to skimp a little bit on some of these bedrooms um, going forward. Um, okay. Let's see. Obviously, we need a bed for KTD. Let's see. What bed are we gonna choose? Let's choose the flyest bed. Uh, I think this is clearly the flyest bed. Oh. Oh boy. That's the one. Yeah, you're right. He doesn't have a window, huh? No, we have to have a window. We'll put this, we'll put this bad boy in here. All right. Let's see. KTD, you know what he needs? He needs a microphone. I'm gonna get KTD a microphone. What else does KTD need? KTD needs... Yeah, right? The vault does have some prime windows. I mean, you know, things might change. We'll see what happens. I might switch some things around. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see what happens. Oh, yeah. Oh yeah. 
absolutely. Uh, let's see, what else? What else should we put in KTD's room? Mm, he's got a microphone. He's a creative sim, so we can put one of those little like art stations in here. Let's see, because I know he'll need it. Oh, you know what? We should get him a keyboard. Hold on, activities and skills, music. Where's the keyboard? There it is. What color keyboard? Oh yeah, oh yeah, this bad boy right here. Okay, so we've got a microphone, we got a keyboard in KTD's room. Let's see, let's get, let's get a little bedside table maybe. Something fancy, something, oh yeah. We can put like a little lamp on it, put a lamp on his bedside table. Oh, let's give him a lava lamp. Perfect. All right. Beautiful. All right. Yeah, actually, gosh, I've never used the vault. I don't know how long it has to, how big it has to be. <laughs> Duck security Scrooge, super extra large, smart vault. Oh, I need like a bigger wall. Ah, shit. Uh, okay, we'll have to figure that out. I'm not gonna do it right now. It seems a bit sexy for a child. Well, listen, whose show is this? <laughs> if you want to create less sexy rooms for your children, then you you get you get your own show. That's what you need to do. <laughs> Maybe we can have. A <laughs> Maybe we can have a uh, a contest who about who can create the sex. Ashley, what do you think about that? All right. ATD is so bad. Oh, we didn't assign him his bed. We gotta do that. Man, this fucking house. <laughs> Sexy kids' bedrooms. Uh, fucking stairs that don't work. People are freaking climbing ladders to get from here to there. This isn't good. Oh, look how cute this is. Ew. Delia Payne is gross again. Again. All right, Diamond David, you're going to have to give her a bath. This is ridiculous. Someone cleaned up in here, though. There was pee on the floor. It's gone now. <laughs> Juice box is just like, oh my god. Stop. <laughs> Get some leftovers. I am excited to have a volcano, though. That'll be fun. Okay, Claire Bear. You... Oh, not Claire Bear. God damn it. Deal your pain. There we go. I like that the distance between the fridge and the table is so far that Sims decide to just stand in front of the fridge and eat instead of going to the table. Whoops. Oh well. There's just things of popcorn everywhere. All right. Oh, she's in better shape now. Okay. She's gonna need some food. So she can say food please. Man, she does not have a good relationship with David. It's not good. Is the governor's pee still on the floor? Let's find out. Where was it? Oh yeah, it was right here. No, it's it's gone. The governor's pee is gone. He is asleep in his room again. Oh, I don't think we paid our bills. Whoops. Uh, let's see. I don't think the kids can do it. I think parents have to do it so. where's the bills pay bills wow 
David totally just gave up on uh, feeding Delia Payne, looks like. I really don't, I don't want her to eat that. So, we're going to have her eat a hamburger off the floor. That's fine. <laughs> okay, whatever happened to Lloyd Legacy Sharp? He is upstairs in KTD's room for some reason. He's the only toddler who decides to wander up the stairs. I love it. All right, we're just going to teleport him here. Open. <gasps> oh my god, he's scared. He saw a ghost. Where's the ghost? There's a ghost somewhere. Oh, I didn't see it. He got scared. Where the hell was the ghost? And what are his arms doing in this picture? What? That is definitely not supposed to look like that. Do you see this? That is some weird mapped out. I don't even. What the fuck? So where the fuck was the ghost? I didn't see it. Man. I don't know. Dang. Oh well. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and cheat for some more money. So I don't have to think about it. Oh. Why didn't it work? Oh. What is happening? I spell it wrong? Oh, I must have spelled it wrong. <laughs> uh, Eddie's not a ghost anymore. You gotta keep up with the lore. Okay. Aw, he's scared. This is a new color. Yeah, so um, the scared emotion is new with today's update. So... If you, uh, I assume it's today's. It could have been yesterday or the day before, I guess. So you're going to want to update your game. All right. David, Matt, Ashley, update your game. Okay. Oh, there was a ghost. I just saw it. Oh, wait, no. I think that was fire. Ugh. Where's the ghost? Look at these children. It's 2... Oh my god, it's 2 a.m. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay. Whoopsie. Here, eat these burgers off the floor. You fucking go to bed, idiot. Okay, he's already going to bed. But you know what? I want to tell him to go to bed so he actually sleeps. Okay. So she needs to get leftovers. Then she bed. Oh my god, where's Claire? Oh, Claire! Oh god! Okay, Claire, go here. Diamond David's making something. Oh, there's a ghost! There she is! Mary Greenberg. <laughs> there's a fucking ghost in the house. I love it. Ah, oh, ghost! <laughs> Slam was done. just like, whatever, man. I've seen worse. No one's even, like, noticing this ghost. Imani's just like, yeah, whatever, man. It happens. Okay. Oh, my God. These children need to go to bed. Stop climbing the stairs. What is happening? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god potty help let's see I feel like they're busy I think Imani's not busy uh Lloyd what are you doing you're gonna wake up the governor oh the governor's where is he he's not there why are you going there he's not even there what the fuck be called to meal I don't even know what's happening right now KTD, you got to go to sleep, man. Okay. Wow. I feel like I've really failed as a parent here. All right. Stop eating. You need to go to bed. Stop eating. You need to go to bed. These poor children. 
Okay, she needs to go potty. Oh, David Thomas made food and then called his family to a meal. Wow. That is adorable. I cannot believe that that is what happened just now. All right, where's Lloyd? Lloyd is on the stairs again. On the stairs again. For some reason, Lloyd is on the stairs. Man, he's such an attention whore. <laughs> His attention thing is always down. <laughs> David insert failed. I guess you're. I guess you're right. What happened to that ghost? She disappeared. Sometimes they'll haunt things. They'll like, you know, jump inside of a counter and make it move. <laughs> yes. For some reason. Lloyd really likes going up and down these stairs. I don't understand. Look at the look at the eyes these two are having at each other. Whoa, look at that. I don't even know what's happening right now. Oh, okay, he's just talking. Claire. That's not Claire. That's Delia. I'm sorry, Mlav. I don't know why I keep calling her the wrong name. Claire, what are you doing? Go to bed. Go to bed. No. Don't sleep there. Go to bed. No. Is someone on the ladder? Is that why she won't fucking go up the stairs? I don't understand. Sleep in your bed. Sleep. Thank you. What is all this? She's very lonely from low social. And she needs to be a bear. I don't. I don't really don't care about this bear thing. Okay. All right, everything's going to be okay. I am very interested, though, in what's happening right here. Hmm. Oh, yeah, talking about cleaning. Sexy. Oh, aw. I was kind of hoping something interesting was going to happen. It didn't. David is going to go take a nap at 5 or 4 a.m. There's no... How is Claire going to be able to go to school? Look at this. Claire is going to be truant. Oh, God. They're all going to be truant. Okay, no. Juice Box is going to make it to school. I can't imagine that these two will. <laughs> Whoops. Fuck that shit up. <laughs> Uh, I think that this game has proved that David nor Serp are dream daddies. <laughs> Nightmare daddies. Maybe not Serp, but definitely the governor of New Jersey. <laughs> uh, I like him complaining as he climbs the ladder. Uh, uh. All right, KTD. No. I don't want you to do that. I want you to take a shower. Okay. And then you can get some food. Imani is still here. I just want to throw that out. She never went home. She is still here. Not sure. Oh my god! <laughs> so Amazon is in the sex dungeon. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god she's in the hot tub you know I'm not even mad at it <laughs> and that was the day that Simply the Jess was banned <laughs> oh god she's drowning now the slime was on no Oh no, I think she was just playing. Okay, good. Holy shit. That was upsetting. Okay, sleep. Go to your bed and sleep. <laughs> oh my god, it could have been really bad. Oh. Wow. Yeah, right? Apparently we do need a kid-friendly hot tub. Jesus. Jesus. 
All right, she's going to bed. He's going to get some food. All right. <sighs> Speaking of which, why am I sleepy? Okay. Yes, he is just sleeping on a couch outside. Why not? Oh, he's awake. He's contemplating life. I feel like this outfit doesn't um, show off how jacked he is. <laughs> You're right, I'm laughing. That is how Slamazon would go. It would be death by hot tub. Uh-oh. Claire Bear is very sad. That's not Claire Bear! Oh, she had a fucking nightmare again. Nap. Just nap. When is her birthday? All right, we've got some time. We got time. Nap, you damn idiot. Okay. Um, I think we're gonna let Lloyd sleep a little bit more. Where's Juice Box? Juice Box needs to get out of bed. Let's have him. Oops. Just oh my god! Just use the toilet. Oh, he wants to do a cannonball. That's cute. He wants to be friendly with David. All right. Well, the boys are going to make it to school today. The girls, I don't think, are going to make it to school today. All right. I changed my mind. We're going to get because he needs a bath. Ask for a bath. We'll ask your money. I guess she's still here. I mean, I'm sure she has her own needs. Where is she? Where is Imani? Hmm, I don't know. Oh, there she is. She's coming down the ladder. Aw, <laughs> oh, Dan, you missed it. There was a ghost, and then Slamazon almost drowned in the hot tub. And KTD aged up to a kid. All right, KTD's off to school. No, you're not going to play. You're going to go to school. Yeah, go to school. I don't think he did his homework. All right. <laughs> don't meddle. Get out of here, Governor. I don't need you meddling. I knew you were going to meddle. All right, we're asking for a bath again. Come on. Come on. <laughs> All right. Why is it taking him so long to get out the door? Go. Okay. All right. So when this is done, we got to work on some skills. Ugh. That imagination skill is atrocious. I think who's got, oh, he might have it in his inventory and I can't get to that. That's frustrating. Okay, that's okay. Uh, okay, he will draw with Llama. And where's Claire Bear? Oh my God, her name's not Claire Bear. Yikes. I have her sleep. Okay. All right. All right. David's going to work. There he goes. Perfect. Okay. The kids are alone with the governor all day. That's going to be really bad, but that's okay. Ah, I think he made a drink. Yep. The governor is drinking out of... The oh, so it is a bar, a liquor bar. Oh, it must have been a kid, because I don't think the kids can... Yeah. They can't get a drink out of the bar. I know. It's time for her to go to school, but... Oh, no, she can go. Go to school. What about Claire? Yeah, she's awake now. She can go to school. Go to school. <laughs> Change into bear outfit and go to school. <laughs> Ridiculous. Someone's getting a phone call. What is love? 
We found an unsent love letter from Juicebox to his teacher and his desk today. Nothing racy, but we thought you should know. He's in big trouble. Cute, but inappropriate. We'll talk. <laughs> I think it's cute, but inappropriate. <laughs> Aw, Claymore is so sad. Look at her sad little walk. I don't know why she went out this door and around this way. The layout of this house is awful. There she goes. She's gone all the way around. To walk out the front door to be two and a half hours late to school. It's fine. Alright. Now we can focus on these stupid kids. Uh, let's see. Delia Payne. She's a little bit hungry. But we could stand... Let's see. Uh, what does she need? Oh wow, she's maxed out her movement skill. It's pretty good. Let's do thinking. All right. I think with Lloyd, we might actually get there. We might actually be able to max out all of the skills. Although he's already fucking tired. Ugh, fine. <laughs> Wait, what's the hottest goss you've heard all day? I missed it. Get that cheddar, David. Oh no. I don't know. Did I say it? Am I just confused? Slamazon is the class all-star today, and she gets to be interviewed by her entire class. She's feeling nervous and kind of excited until someone says, how come you always get A's? Should she try to, for something witty or just be real like the teacher said? Mm, I feel like she tried to be witty. Oh no, this class is super long for some reason. <laughs> Unfortunately, we don't have a pottery wheel in The Sims 4. They had a pottery wheel in The Sims 2. Oh man, these kids are just gonna go to sleep? How boring. This is the exciting content you came to see. Uh oh. Yeah, we're supposed to be on triple speed, but we definitely are not, I don't think. My poor game. <laughs> we can get a folding chair. I just don't think we can put Bernie on it. Maybe when one of these two ages up. They still, they still have a few days. Six days until they technically age up. We should be able to stop that from happening though. Or just cheat to put them back to adults again. It's three o'clock. The kids should be home. Okay, here we go. Kids are home. Okay, I think everyone's an A student. Let's see. Claire Bear is. Slamazon is. <gasps> Juice Box is. KTD's not. But he needs to go to bed. Yikes. Yikes on bikes. That's not good. Juice Box needs to have some fun. Maybe he can play this arcade game. Slamazon needs to pee. I'll have her use the toilet. And then juice box. Somebody was really dirty. No. What the fuck? Here, take a bubble bath. What, what the fuck? This game is so fucking funny. Oh my goodness gracious. Wow. Claire Bear's like angry. She's hangry. As usual, Claire Bear is hangry. She's sad because it's hot. I'm sorry, Claire Bear. Ah! Her name is not Claire Bear. The governor will become Bernie by the front door. 
<laughs> I know. One new core harm. I didn't even bother to put a thermostat in this house or um, fire alarms either. I didn't bother. It's more it's more interesting that way, right? It's more fun. Oh, you know what we should get? There's a weather control machine. That'd be kind of fun, right? Yeah, the stones are temperature regulating, right? If you were hot, you could just lay down on the floor and you'd probably be cold. It'd be nice. I really do want to see what happens if someone, like, jumps into the shark pool. I think you can. Remove sharks, play, jump in, admire, add natural cleaner. The water garden denizens have recently been fed? When did they get fed? Huh. I don't know. Should... No, there's not a robot butler. But we could get a butler. That would be interesting. Should we have the governor jump in the shark pool just to see what happens? Oh, David's home. We'll have David do it. I think Imani must have gone home. This is, like, almost peaceful. Until you think about the fact that those sharks would probably kill you. What kind of sharks do you think those are? They kind of look like bull sharks, maybe? They're a little small. Maybe they're baby bull sharks. All right, come on, David. Hurry up. Moment of truth. Could be. Nurse sharks. Ah, <laughs> 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 oh, nothing. Here, play. Play with it. Maybe he'll get sucked in. Uh oh. Oh boy. <laughs> oh my god. It's Yama Flow. Oh, oh, it's Yama Flow. <laughs> that was ridiculous. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> oh well. He didn't die. There's always next time. KTD is awake. KTD, do your homework. Oh, and get this out of your inventory. This is not for you anymore. This is a tablet for baby. Speaking of babies. Oh, God. Claire, what's going on with... Oh, God. I don't know why I keep calling her that. I'm sorry. Uh, let's work on, yeah, let's do more thinking. I feel like Delia Payne's a thinker. Oh, there's Imani. She is still here. I can't imagine that she's, like, feeling good. Her needs have to be all over the place. Okay, Claire Bear definitely needs some social interaction. So, what am I looking at? Oh, that's the reflection of somebody on the ladder. I thought someone was drowning in the pool. Two people on the ladder. Two people merging into each other on the ladder. It's fine. I know it's almost Delia's birthday. There we go, yeah. They need to chit chat with each other. She would totally impishly pester him. Is he too hot? Oh, he is overheating. Well, just another way to die, I suppose. All right, juice box. You gotta. Damn, man. You gotta take a bath. Get out of here. Slam is on. You need to take a nap, dude. Oh, cool. She made it across the monkey bars three times. Excellent. Good. I didn't even have to try for that one. 
Uh, KTD is doing his homework, and then he's going to have to fucking sleep again. This is ridiculous. You guys have the best beds, and for some reason you still... Uh-oh, somebody's crying. Lloyd is crying. Lloyd is such a little attention whore, I swear to God. Are you really going to sleep again? They spend all their time sleeping. Not thrilled about it. What do I do with that? There it is. Oh, this is working for his attention. Good. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he wanted to watch me play The Sims. That's why he's crying. <laughs> so sad. Okay, imagination. We can have him play dolls for imagination. His thinking skill's almost at three. No! Oh! oh no! Somebody's burning to death! Oh god. She's gotta get out of this outfit. Oh my god, oh my god. <laughs> no, no, no. No, please. Oh my god. Whew, okay. Whew. Here, I'm gonna have her... I'm gonna have her jump in the pool. Ugh, oh, she can't jump in the pool. Alright, swim. Just swim. That'll that'll cool her down. And she won't fucking die. Whew! That could have been really bad. Oh my gosh. Okay, she's hot, but she's not gonna fucking die. It's because of that stupid bear outfit she's been wearing. The temperature outside is burning. It's super hot. But we don't have a thermostat again. Although, I suppose the kids probably could set the thermostat. Here, play dolls with him, you jerk. Don't just stand there. Can I ask him to play dolls? Ask to play. Oh, I didn't mean like... KTD, you need to go to sleep. Go to sleep. Thank you. Alright, Slamazon's already asleep somewhere. Oh good, she's in- Ah! <laughs> I did not expect to see David just fucking hanging out. Just hanging out. <laughs> Sitting on Slamazon's bed. <laughs> Oh my god. David, you creep. <laughs> I like to watch you sleep. <laughs> okay. Oh boy. Juice box is not in good shape. Let's see. Juice box needs to get some leftovers. He needs to use the bathroom. Lloyd Legacy Sharp is just standing here when we could be learning something, except now he needs to sleep. It's 9.45. He can sleep now. You can sleep now. Claire Bear is also asleep. Her name's not Claire Bear. Her name's not Claire Bear. KTD is asleep. You know what? I need to set auto lights. No. Auto lights. All lights. That way I'll know if people are asleep just by looking at their bedroom. Okay, yeah, you need to go to sleep. We're working on Juice Box's situation. Claire Bear. Yeah. Who are you talking to? Oh, Imani. Just gonna get some leftovers. Juice Box has the situation. It's not great. Okay. We got about 10 minutes left to go. Ish. 13 ish. Uh, so, I know, I feel so bad. I, I don't know why, I think it's the haircut, because maybe the haircut was the same when, uh, Claire Bear was a toddler. I don't, I don't know, I don't understand why I keep calling her that. I don't know. Uh, anyway, so, uh, as we voted, uh, uh, 
Ashley Volts or AC Volts will join the roster next week of toddlers in uh, the QAW house. Um, when did the Bernie arrive? There is no Bernie. Maybe someday. Um, <laughs> the rooms are too sexy. He's been there for about 30 minutes. Oh my God. <laughs> I see it now. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't notice it earlier, but I do appreciate it. I like him. Um, I actually, I, <laughs> I bought um, a St. Bernie candle off of Etsy. It's like, you know, a St. candle, but it's got Bernie's face on it. And I bought it so that I'll remember to wish him good health and long life. <sighs> because I'm not a religious person, but I do really hope that Bernie stays alive for a really long time. <laughs> anyway... <laughs> Um, so AC Volts will be joining the roster next week. Oh my god, he's literally just standing here. He's just standing here. Is he like bugged out or something? Reset. Alright, use. Then you can sleep. Uh oh, he's bugged out. What is happening? He's bugged out. What do I do? Reset him again. Reset. Go here. Okay, now use the bathroom. Can you do it? Uh-oh. Okay, good. Okay, good. There he goes. Um, so, yeah, so AC Volts will be joining the roster. I think that's the third time I've said that. Uh, I know he is going all paranormal activity. And in fact, actually, will I have the newest pack by the next time we play this game? I think I will. Yeah, today's the 23rd, and the new pack comes out on the 26th. So I will have, um, which is the uh, paranormal pack. Um, so we can actually go all paranormal activity. Look, and now he's just standing here in front of the toilet. What the hell? I said use the toilet. Wow, what is happening? <laughs> is it just this room? Is it this toilet? He turns around. Maybe we'll try the other one. That's freaking weird. All right. Let's try this toilet. Oh. No! I hope he's not bugged out. Oh, man. No! What is happening? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Let's see if he'll like sleep on the couch or something. Go sit on the couch. I know he has to pee so bad. He's doing a little duck walk. No, we definitely did not use too many cheats. I think it's probably because the house is so big and there's so many people in it that the game starts to just like not work as well plus it's got like a bunch of animation going on in the background like this yeah i don't know i'm sure he'll be fine it's fine um <laughs> so <laughs> hopefully they're not all gonna do that i guess we'll find out um so yeah i'll have the new pack next week um, we'll have a new household member. Hopefully the game will still work with nine people. Um, oh, and, <laughs> and, uh, and, uh, you know, if there are things that you uh, would like to see, you know, are you kind of hoping someone, is, you know, up the ante on that, um, you know, would you like, should we, you know, focus on getting these kids to age up? You know, are we going to keep adding toddlers? Do we want to see uh, a love connection in this household uh, between certain men? Um, you know, whatever, whatever you guys want. Would, let me know. We'll see if we can put it together. Um, 
Also, tonight, there's all sorts of interesting programming on uh, 2MB Studios. Um, the thing that I'm most excited for, uh, the uh, feminist romance novel, live reading uh, on 2MB Studios, I believe, at 8 o'clock tonight, um, which is really exciting. Civil War, Ghost Farm, Ghost Farm, interesting. I'm seeing, yeah, Love Connection, Ghost Farm. Civil War. Hmm. QAW Civil War. That would be. Oh my gosh. And then we could like try and get them to kill each other somehow. That would be interesting to have like two different factions. Hmm. Yeah. That'd be cool. Anyway. <laughs> have like, you know, like the, the generation versus whoever else. The generation versus the juiceration. Yeah, something is wrong. The game is fucked up right now. I think it needs to be restarted. Oh, well, we'll just pause it. Um, <laughs> Lord of the Flies. <laughs> Yikes. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, um, I'm not sure what, oh, God, I meant to check. I'm not sure what else is on tonight. Um, so Feminist Romance Novel is at, is at, eight and then oh right and then sleepover is at uh is at 10 and uh oh i'm sorry knights of prospect is at seven uh so knights of prospect is a uh live role-playing improv show which is very cool you should definitely check it out at seven o'clock um someone peed their pants while the game was paused that makes sense um and <laughs> feminist romance novel uh live reading is at eight and then Sleepover is at 10. QAW is at 8 on Thursday. You should definitely uh, tune in to watch all of these characters beat each other up in the ring. Uh, and then, obviously, you're going to want to tune in again on Saturday uh, at 1 p.m. right here for more Simply the Just Presents Quarantine Action Wrestling. Oh, no, Quarantine Action Parenting. Excuse me. Uh, and since the game is bugged out, I think we might just have to, <laughs> we might just have to end here because, oh, there she goes. Wait, Ronnie there she goes, let's see if she, oh gosh, she's got all kinds of stuff in her inventory now. He's having a bladder emergency. Okay. I think it just needed to catch up. The game just needed to catch up. Everything's fine. They're going to be fine. Juicebox pissed himself, I think. That's okay. It happens. Slamazon's coming down for some reason. Oh, no, I don't want her to do that. She needs to eat. She needs to eat something. Oh, poor Claybear is falling asleep on her feet. Okay, good. The game just needed to catch up a little bit. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> All right. Yeah, on on the uh on the docket for next week. You did miss plugs. Did you want to plug something? You can you can still plug something. Knights of Prospect at 7. Yep. Yep, I did say that part a couple of times, I think. I know. Um Yes, John is the Red the Unready is the game master. He's the I guess it's not a dungeon master because it's not Dungeons and Dragons, which apparently he doesn't like. And like, I mean, okay, but that's like your opinion, man. Um <laughs> I don't know why I said that. I don't know, fight me. You're going to be on the other side of <laughs> the civil war. I see what it's like. It's a murder simulation and you only get better by killing. Yeah, whatever. Depending de depending on the DM. Um, listen, the points don't matter, okay? We all know that. Uh, it's 4.11 a.m. Where are all these people? What is happening? Everything is awful. Oh, my God. All right, at least he's coming to the bathroom. Whatever happened to Juicebox? Where's Juicebox now? He's at the bottom of the stairs. He's going to pass out. He's not going to make it to school today. This is ridiculous. Oh, God, where's he going? 
No, 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 no. He's about to have... Ugh, he's gonna pass out. Oh my god. This is impossible. I just want to throw out that when I play, like, by myself, and I'm like... I'm, like, really good at this game. <laughs> Usually. <laughs> when I'm not, like, entirely distracted. His hygiene's all the way at the top. Why is he even taking a bath? I thought that... I don't even know. I don't know. I don't know what's happening. This is awful. Life? You think life is a murder simulation and you only get better by killing? Yikes. Stay away from Blumpkin bread. IRL. Oh my god, you guys. I saw a promising young woman last night. And... Ugh. My life... Is... Messed up. <laughs> I don't even know what else to say. <laughs> Let's just say it was really good. And it messed with my brain a little bit. Ugh. Anyway. Oh, God. The plot was bonkers. And it was so good, though. It was so good. And... Ugh. It, like, had just the right amount of, of like, like, validating and frustrating. Ugh. It was, a uh, it was a wild ride, and I strongly recommend it. Anyway, it is 2.59, my friends, and the children are running around like chickens with their heads cut off. So that means that it's time for me to say goodbye. Again, don't forget, uh, Knights of Prospect at 7. The uh, feminist uh, romance novel at 8 and the sleepover at 10 p.m. Quarantine action wrestling on Thursdays at 8 p.m. And then make sure you come back right here on Saturday at 1 p.m. for more quarantine action parenting on Simly the Jess. Have a great day, folks. Bye bye. Dag dag.